Hello Cancer, welcome back. Well, I assume if you've been here before, welcome back. If you're brand new, then just simply welcome to both sides of the story. This is a spread that I have conceived of for the purposes of these readings that I like to bring you once a month looking at both sides of the story. They do tend to bounce off the main September readings for the signs. So if you haven't seen your September reading yet, I do recommend that you hop on over and have a look at that at some point. Generally, we tap into a similar kind of message. Um, I'll be looking at you today and I will be looking at a significant somebody in your life. Please do go ahead and set the intention right now of who you would like that person to be. More often than not, I do tap into romantic connections. But if you want a friend or a family member that you would like to look at, you can interpret the cards in a less romantic and more um, platonic kind of way. It's entirely up to you how you take this reading, take what resonates, take what does not. This is you in this connection. Yang, action, do something, movement, taking action, masculine energy. And I very much picked up on a lot of feminine energy. Um, I do feel I'm connecting to some male Cancerians right now. Or I have females that are cross-watching for a male Cancer at the moment. Even if you are a female Cancer, it does not mean that you cannot sit in a masculine energy. I, I'm saying masculine, not male. Let's see your person. Breathe, breathe. Is your person breathing a sigh of relief in some way? Has your person found a new sense of freedom? Look at all of these clouds. Look at all this blue on both of these. Both of these cards here. You are being called to take action in this connection. And your person is being called to take a step back. To take a, a, a sigh of relief or a big deep breath. That meditative energy here. Uh, it's When I do these readings, I generally very clearly get energy and direction and movement going one way towards the other. And this time around, this energy is moving here. And this energy is receiving. This, of course, could be your person. And this could be you. For some of you, that's the way around it will resonate. If you're cross-watching for a Cancer, this could be you and this could be your Cancer. Or the other way around. It's entirely up to you to discern. But in the recent past of this connection, something changed. Something changed here recent very near very recent past something changed um and it led to a feeling of uncertainty what's next what now what do we do now um everything changed everything changed and it's it would seem it's up to you, Cancer. I will proceed as though this is you. If you've decided it's a different way around, um, please do disregard me saying you. But it would seem it's up to you to do something, to do something about it, to take some kind of action here. Present energy of this connection is the sun. Freedom, liberation, release. That's very much what this person is sitting in here future energy sowing a seed sowing a seed that energy of let's offer something real um something being very grounded kind of that counting your blessings kind of energy looking at what it is you've got where it is you'd like to go and how it is you can start thinking about laying some very solid tangible groundwork a foundation for what it is you can do moving forward there is a deep sense of relief going on in this connection, specifically on this person's side here. Your person here, breathe, it does not seem to be in too much of a hurry to be doing much right now, but they do have an open heart. They're kind of letting the universe decide, like, you know, like letting nature take its course. Um, they're releasing anxiety, they're releasing tension, um, they're being very patient 
incredibly patient and it would seem that circumstances within this connection right now are supporting action on your part here cancer it's okay to make the first move and i believe you need to trust that you will quickly know where it is you stand should you take said action you are absolutely being encouraged to move to do something to move towards this person here within this connection okay i see a very positive outcome coming in and again right now i feel like we have reached some kind of understanding together here after a sudden change in the recent past let's get some more cards on the table i'm going to okay so this is you how you feel about your person right now is that they have put in a lot of effort you appreciate the effort that they've put in you can see how hard they've worked you can see how much pride they have you can see that they are trying to improve trying to work on this trying to make this better you can see how much patience they've put in there's gratitude here for the effort that your person has put in how do they feel about you they feel you're distant from them they feel you're holding back from them they feel that you do, do love them they would like you to stand up for this connection to stand up and be counted to listen to them to be compassionate and gentle and kind and authoritative they 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 love you a great deal and they are being very patient with you at this moment in time the energy that you're sending i'm going to clarify all of these so we will come back to this the energy that you are sending this person is the page of cups lovely apologies apologies tentative slow messages of love kind of not too overly committal not too intense or deep um this is like sliding into their dms i miss you i love you thinking about you that kind of it's it's small it's small um it's certainly a little bit humble as well the energy they're sending to you is the ace of wands let's get this party started <laughs> essentially they, they, the energy they're sending to you is that you are where their focus and direction and desire um, they, they kind of got you in their sights essentially they're passionate about you they feel that there's potential they want to follow their heart and their heart is leading them to you what do you wish you could say is the page of wands what you wish you could say is let's go let's do this I'm excited I want to do this I I want to go down this path with you but again page 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 small small baby steps it's a thought it's an idea it's the beginning it's the possibility of it's the opportunity for it's not fully manifested yet what they wish they could say to you is the lovers i love you i long for you i yearn for you i want to connect for you with you i'm in love with you i want to open my heart i want you to express how you feel i want to express how i feel the lovers is a kind of gemini whose ruling planet is mercury so it's about communication it's a deeply felt attraction let's get some clarifiers on all of these and see if we can just open this up even more um, how you feel about them is this gratitude for all of the effort and all of the hard work that they've put in you can see how much effort they've put into this connection and you appreciate that a lot a great deal you recognize it you can see it let's see what else we can get to go with this so all the pages seem to be on your side moving this way so this action that you need to be taking looks like it will be small ace of pentacles here it is it's almost like you're looking at everything they've done and all the action and all the hard work they've put in and all of the time and energy and dedication that they've put into this connection and you feel this person deserves something tangible now they deserve it 
They've earned it. This again, it's an ace, which is the thought, the idea, the seed, the opportunity, the possibility of something tangible. You really would like to give them something tangible now. And perhaps that is the action that you will be taking. It will be that sowing of the seed of this idea. How they feel about you is that you've held back from them, but they do feel that you love them. Why is this here? The Ace of Cups, look at all these aces. Wow, they would like you to open up your heart, to take their gift of love. They want the emotions to begin to flow within this. They want to renew this love or, or engage in this love. You inspire feelings of love within them. They're ready for this. They're ready for you. They want you. It's very clear. Energy that you're sending them again is this kind of slightly humble, apologetic, but also emotionally curious energy. The Empress. Wow. She popped up for you in your September reading, Cancer. The Empress, the energy of Venus, Taurus and Libra. Beautiful. It's a period of growth. It's it's a connecting, a reconnecting. It's a strong urge to nurture and take care. This, this, there is a humility and a humbleness here in coming towards this beautiful energy and just expressing, wow, you are amazing. Wow, you are beautiful. You've done so much for me. You've worked so hard. You've given so much. Let me give back to you now. Let me give back to you. energy that they are sending you is let's get this party started the hanged man oh, it's like wake up and see me cancer you are you have you've seen them you know you can see them now you can see how hard they've worked the humility and the gratitude that's coming from this side is immense um i don't I'm not sure if we fully expressed all of this yet. I do think we will. I do think we will because the Yang card here tells me you are taking action. You are about to take action. And I think this person feels that they are essentially waiting for you to do that. They are seeing this differently. They are perhaps now approaching this in a more enlightened kind of way. Um, there are... There is that energy of release, that relief, almost. This is hum humility and gratitude, and this is relief. So what do you wish you could say is that, you know, the possibilities and the opportunities, can, can we kind of, can we move? Can we go this way, perhaps? I would like you to follow. Shall we do this? Strength. Lovely. Lovely. Looking for, like, another solution another solution here but again it's generous it's protective it's calm it's kind that strength of character that humility and the grace that's coming from here it, again it, it's this is gratitude and humility and this is relief what do they wish they could say to you along with the lovers is the devil <laughs> <laughs> this is like saying look cancer i love you but flipping out you're like my kryptonite you really are like i'm trying to resist you here i'm trying to be moody with you i'm trying to be angry with you and unfortunately for me i love you so much i just can't do any of that it's driving me insane how much i love you but I'm getting a real humour from that energy right now coming off. This is lovely. It's lovely. This is... We love each other. We're not really sure if we have all of the answers. We're not really sure where it is we're going, but we would like it to be somewhere. And we'd like to take the first few steps now together this is like you here holding out your hand and saying please come i don't know where we're going but and this person going oh 
fine only because I love you <laughs> you know it's it's beautiful there's forgiveness and relief and there's gratitude and humility and kindness and compassion and love and love above all else and love what a relief because your September read was heavy heavy and I feel within the last week and a half or so we have shifted out of that heaviness and I like that a lot I'm very relieved to see the cards that we have on the table here today I will take this over to Patreon for an extended so if you are on Patreon of course you can ex access this extended here but for your five dollar pledge you will also have access to all of the extendeds for all of the other signs as well so you can cross watch for your person in this extended I'll be looking at your action towards each other specifically the action that I see here I'll be looking at seeing if I can get some dialogue going between you like a hypothetical conversation that you might be having I'll look at the outcome I'll see if I can get a sense of timing for you with the Lenormand cards and I'll run through each of the signs as well to see if we can get a little bit more specific for you depending on who it is you're dealing with cancer it's been a pleasure as always good luck with this take care and I'll be back really really soon